No doubt one of the most dominant big men in history. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the NWO from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 328 pounds, Kevin Nash! Why wouldn't you want to hang around Big Sexy? Don't you recall all the chaos Kevin Nash and his fellow NWO cohorts caused not only in WWE, but WCW as well? Got yeah. me all nervous and tongue-tied when this guy's around. I remember it well. I'm kind of hoping he power bombs you through a table like Bischoff. Shh. Brute force personified. Nash looking to obliterate all competitors. This is a brawler who learned his craft on the streets of Detroit. Man, he is so big. All power. This will not be pretty. The roof just came off this place. And his opponent from Glasgow, Scotland, weighing in at 230 pounds. Rowdy, Rowdy. Well, the only thing more dangerous than Roddy Piper with his ring gear on is Roddy Piper with a mic in his hand. Can take a man down with words before the bell even rings. Roddy Piper has made a career out of that. A master manipulator. Expect the unexpected when Hot Rod comes to town. We are guaranteed to have ourselves a knockdown, drag out fight tonight. I'm sure Hot Rod has some explosive action on tap. As Ronnie used to say, when they think they have the answers, I change the questions. Always wondered what that meant. I think that means even Roddy barely knows what he's going to do next. Roddy doesn't care about fair play or competition or any of that. He's just here to kick some you-know-what in the most unhinged way possible. And maybe chew some bubble gum while he's at it. And with a guy like Kevin Nash, you know that he cares about getting the win at any cost. He gets paid to dominate his opponent, Saxton, and dominate he does. Oh, an arm breaker. That arm's going to be sore for a while. Could affect all their offense. No, oh, no, 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 that'll break his arm. Vicious. That dominant style of Nash is getting challenged there. Unhinged offensive display from Piper. Whoa. Counters with an attack on Piper. Get him into the corner. Oh, impressive counter. Big back body drops. 
Captain Kick. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. Catches a punch. Suplex. Oh. Here it comes. Nicely done. be the hardest. Oh, an elbow drop for added measure. He's in the Masada. I don't think people realize the amount of strength it takes to hurl someone like that. Tagging this outside. This could be good. Uh-oh. Elbow drop. He's starting to struggle here. Yeah, it looks like Nash has plenty of diesel left in the tank. Club. Popped right in the face. Nothing fancy here. Backbreaker. Backbreaker. Planning on what to do next. He's back in so close. Sleeper hold cinched in deep. Fading, fading. Oh no, this is not where he wants to be. Yeah, but can he roll on his body? Can he roll? Can he roll here and counter this? Fight it, fight it. And breaks out of the sleeper. He 
can't believe it. As devastating as Nash's maneuver was, it still wasn't enough. Tossed into the corner. Wicked clothesline. as he finds his footing. From the top, diving double axe handle. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Consecutive attacks, keeping Hot Rod off his game. This is how you deal with Piper, by keeping him under relentless offensive pressure so he doesn't get a chance to use it. Here's another look. Here is your winner, Rowdy, Roddy Piper. Nice victory here tonight for Roddy Piper. They really put in some back-breaking work for this victory. Wins in WWE rarely come easy, Saxton, but this one was tougher than most. 